Hello, my name is Xavier Woolard, and this is my population pyramid lab case report. My country is Iceland. This is for Geology 110 Internet. This is a Google map image of where we are in Arizona and where Iceland is located. I'm actually going to show a satellite view of this. So here we are, Phoenix area. And just come right here. And here's Iceland. Go ahead and zoom in. Population pyramid is a graph, graphical illustration that shows the distribution of various age groups and population which forms the shape of a pyramid when the population is growing. It's used in ecology to determine the overall age distribution of a population. The population projections give a picture of what the future size and structure of the population by sex and age might look like. It's made for three components, fertility, mortality, and migration. Iceland population continues to grow at a slower rate to its highest peak in 2055, which is 376,957. After 2055, every five years, the projection slightly decreases down until 2100. In 2100, the population projection is 353,291. Iceland is very low in carbon emissions compared to the United States. The annual emission is 541.3. Per person emission for Iceland is 1.639. Cumulative emission, Iceland is 27.99. Iceland is ranked 180th out of 201 countries with a population of 341,250. People from Iceland immigrate to Poland, Denmark, Sweden, the United States, Germany, Philippines, Lithuania, United Kingdom, Thailand, and Norway. People do not immigrate to Iceland. Um, I didn't find one country that did. Population density. Iceland's density is 3.31 person per kilometer. Iceland is ranked 190th out of 193 in population density. I am comparing it to USA. Population projection. Asia and Africa are the two continents that will continue to grow. In 2050, Europe will start to decrease. Iceland's growth rate is 1.04%. It ranks 121st out of 195 with the world. The number one country in growth rate is Oman and has 5.83%. My three indicators are smoking prevalence for males percent of adults, 17%. It ranks 117 out of 125 countries. Diabetes prevalence percent of population ages 20 to 79 is 6.10%. It ranks 130th out of 196 countries. And physicians per 1,000 people is 3.73. It ranks 18 out of 150. Iceland is higher than the United States with 2.41 per 1,000 people, and it ranks 53. The future of Iceland looks to be in good shape based off the population projections. Today, 2020, population is at 341,250. By 2050, at its peak, it's projected to be 376,683. By 2100, population does decrease, but it's still projected higher than today at 353,291. The history of geological disasters. Iceland lies on the divergent boundary between the Eurasia Plate and the North American Plate. It lies above a hot spot, the Iceland Plume. The plume is believed to have caused the formation of Iceland itself. The eruption of Lakey in 1783 caused much devastation and loss of life, leading to a famine that killed about 25% of the island's population. 2014, Iceland is rising because of climate change with the land freed by melting of the ice caps, rebounding from the earth at a rate of up to 1.4 inch per year. 
Researchers believe the extra uplift could be behind an increase in volcanic activity with three Icelandic eruptions in the last five years, shutting down flights and spewing ash in the air. This is why I had the interest in Iceland because I remember when Iceland's soccer team beat England in the UEFA Euro 2016. In 2016, Iceland's very own Aaron Gunnarsson, who is the captain of Icelandic national team, and Hafbor Bajorsson, who played a role in the Game of Thrones, helped introduce the skull chant to the Minnesota Vikings. You raise your arms to the side, then raise them upwards with a clap, and you yell, skull, then repeat with arms back to your side. On this slide, I have all my references that I used for this assignment. Thank you. I hope everyone is safe.